back to my channel today we are doing a hair and makeup get ready with me so let's get straight into the video today i will be using this gorgeous wig from rpg show which i washed and blow dried and i used shimmer light purple shampoo so let's get straight into it so as soon as you take the wig out the box and put it on you don't really have to do any tweezing um this is like a slightly fuller hairline but i personally believe you should leave it a little bit full just because it does shed over time so naturally this is like the best way to leave your wigs so what i'm gonna do is just make sure it's fitting my ears just like so and i'm actually just gonna take my scissors and cut the lace in a diagonal diagonal crisscross zigzag jagged however you want to call it just do that throughout the whole hairline now i'm going to use my got to be spray and i'm just going to stick this down okay once you're happy with that what you're going to do is essentially decide where you want your parting to be and what type of style you want today i'm actually going to just straighten this just because i don't feel like i feel like sometimes when i curl my hair it makes me look older so i just like straight hair on me so i'm going to just do a middle part and you guys can see i have like a lot of parting space so I'm very happy about that decide where you want your edges some people have theirs more forward some people have theirs more to the side just think about what suits your face shape Okay, once I've kind of cut them and got the shape I want, I'm going to use a tiny bit of got to be gel just to give them the shape I want. And then I'm gonna go on top with my wrap and set mousse. And I also always find that doing it this way helps me to get like baby hairs that will last for the day. Cause I think it's super easy to just use the wrap and set mousse. Like, they do look really soft and really pretty but if you want your client to like have the baby hairs stay and like take take shape it's much easier honestly to do it with gel and then use the mousse on top so that it's not too crispy and hard i'm just curling my edges normally i would do this with um my small flat iron i just can't be bothered to plug it in so just be very careful okay not to burn your edges i'm gonna take my band and just tie my hair down and here is the finished look looks really pretty so let's just do some really really quick 10 minute makeup the makeup i do when i need to go so swipe 
looks really pretty so let's just do our makeup i'm gonna do my no foundation look with different products so let's get into it okay so i'm gonna go in with my laura mercier pure canvas primer and just rub that all over my face i've already put on spf and I'm going to spot conceal with my Lancome Tainted Doll Ultra Wear All Over Concealer in the shade 460. And then for my concealer, I'm going to go in with the MAC Studio Fix 24 Hour Smooth Wear Concealer. And I've got two shades here, which are NC48 and NC. 43 well, really i could have just got nc45 but the nc48 is my mum's one that's too light for her so i just took it <laughs> i'm going to contour bronze with the Too faced born this way concealer in the shade toffee And then I'm just gonna blend that out. And then I'm gonna powder with my mineralized skin finish in dark. For blush I'm going to go into my Too Faced Peach Just Peachy Matte Palette and I'm going to take Peach Cobbler which is this one and I'm going to use that as my blush. Add a little bit of a shimmery blush. This blush is from Fashion Fair but I think the company has dissolved but it's literally like a shimmery rose gold. Then I'm going to line my lips with my Morphe Trendsetter Lip Pencil. Then I'm going to set my face with the Hangover 3-in-1 by Too Faced. And then go on top of that with my Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. Here is the finished look with my hair done, makeup done. This is how you do your makeup in 12 minutes and look presentable. Thank you so much to RPG Show for sponsoring today's video. All the details about this hair will be down below. Hope you guys enjoyed this super quick, super simple hair and makeup look and I will see you all in my next video. Love you long time, bye bye.